Hello and welcome to the CGCA Library. Our library is located in the main building in the high school wing. Come on in, let us show you around. Here we are in the main part of the library. The majority of the books are located here. Our book collection has really grown and is jam-packed with wonderful selections to meet all of your reading and research needs. Everyone who wants to check out a book must attend a library orientation session to learn the rules and procedures of the library. Your signed library contract means that you understand and agree to abide by the library rules. Since there is no full-time media specialist in the CGCA library, everyone has to work cooperatively to keep the library neat and organized. When you are browsing through the stacks and find a book that you would like to take off the shelf and look at, place a book place marker in the shelf in the place where you took the book from. Then, after you are finished looking at it, you will be able to put the book back on the shelf in exactly the same place. Being diligent about putting books back on the shelf neatly and in the proper place is one of the best ways that you can help to keep the library neat and organized. Now let's take a look at how the books in the library are organized. On the longest wall in the main part of the library is where you will find the fiction section. There are many different kinds of fiction, historical fiction, science fiction, fairy tales, picture books, but generally fiction means that the story has been made up from the author's imagination. The fiction section in our library is arranged by age appropriateness and reading difficulty. The upper shelves are for the older and more sophisticated high school and middle school readers, whereas the lower shelves contain books that are better suited to younger and less experienced readers. This is one of the most popular sections of the library, the accelerated reader books. You will see a large gold star hanging over the accelerated reader book shelves. Accelerated Reader Books, for which CGCA has an Accelerated Reader Test, are marked with a gold star on the spine of the book. The library books are also in the process of being labeled with their Lexile numbers. You will find the Lexile of the book on the front cover. NP means that that particular book does not have a Lexile. You should know your own Lexile range so that you can choose books within your appropriate reading ability. Now let's move over to the nonfiction. The entire wall in the entry hall of the library is filled with nonfiction books. Our biography section is quite extensive with something for everyone. Do you happen to know the difference between a biography and an autobiography? This bookshelf is located in the nonfiction section and holds several books about feelings, manners, personal integrity, and character. These are topics on which everyone should be well educated. Also located in the nonfiction section are books about sports. From major league team sports to fishing and skateboarding, there is something for every sports fan here. We recently acquired a large collection of books all about different nations of the world. Take a trip to a faraway land by checking out one of these books. The American History section is also a very popular section. We have over 250 books on this topic. 
This bookshelf contains books that are frequently requested by students and teachers, and also books that are of some of Miss Campbell's personal favorites. If Miss Campbell is in her office while you are visiting the library, feel free to ask her a question or get help finding a book. There is a section in the library for teachers only. CGCA has a very good collection of some of the latest publications in the field of education. There are other things that teachers can check out too. We have a large selection of VHS tapes and DVDs. We even have a VCR if you need one. Tapes and DVDs can be kept out for a week. We even have a modest selection of books on tape. We actually have a fairly large collection of board games available for teacher checkout in the library. Games can be kept out for two weeks at a time. Games are a great way to get those neurons firing. There are other kinds of teaching resources available for checkout as well. This teacher's resource on Shakespeare is really good. It contains a teacher's guide, DVDs, CD, bookmarks, student pages, and lots of great ideas for making Shakespeare accessible to all ages. The CGCA Library also has classroom book sets. The library has ordered all of the extended texts for the first two ELA units for every grade kindergarten through twelfth. No matter what it is you're checking out, remember to enter it into the library checkout book. We operate on the honor system here. Students and teachers write down their names, the dates, and whatever it is that they are checking out from the library that day. Four books can be checked out at one time and can be kept for two weeks. Remember, unless special arrangements have been made, no students are permitted to take books home. Please return your books in the large bin that you see when you enter the library. Books go from the return bin to this book cart getting ready to be reshelved. Feel free to take books from the cart, but please do not take books from the return bin. Thank you for taking this tour of the CGCA Library, and we look forward to seeing you there real soon.